Hello guys and welcome to AVK App Reviews. Today I am going to give you the overview of the latest nightly build of Snapdragon Mod 12. Now the main feature of this build is it has theme engine included. So is the most wanted feature that Snapdragon Mod is included. Currently it is in beta state, but let's check it out. So firstly I am going to show you the Android version provided by this ROM. As you can see this ROM provides Android version 5.0.2. And I am running the latest build that is released on Jan 17. And it's a nightly build by Snapdragon Mod. Now you can update the latest Snapdragon Mod updates through the Snapdragon Mod Update Center. So you don't have to flash the every new build. Now let's check out the customization provided inside this new build. As you can see, there are four options inside per personalization. The first is home, means you can change your launcher. Then next is status bar. Inside you can change the battery status style, that is circle, icon portrait, icon landscape, so I have kept it in circle. Then next is battery percentage, you can change it to hidden or inside or next to icon. Then next is brightness control, you can enable the brightness control on the status bar. Then next is notification count, you can enable or disable notification count on the status bar. I have kept it enabled. Then next customization is notification drawer. You can enable the quick pull down from right hand side of the status bar, as you can see. Then next you can show weather in the status bar, means you can enable the weather in the status bar, as you can see, I have enabled it. The next thing that is the most important thing included in this build is quick setting panel, means you can change the position of toggle inside quick setting. As you can see I have changed my toggle setting, now I can move the Wi-Fi over the top, as you can see, so it's in top on the right hand side. So it's move now. So you can rearrange the uh, toggles as your requirement. Then you can add only two other toggles that are given by CM mod. But in the next build, it will be uh, changed so it, they can add more toggles. <coughs> then next is you can uh, enable or disable the first, uh, enlargement of first row means. Now the first row is enlarged, but you can disable it. So now the first row is not enlarged, as you can see. Then next is advanced location setting. Means you can enable the advanced location setting in the quick toggle. I have enabled it, so when you click on location, it will show the advanced settings. So it's a good option to have. Then next, or customization is the main option, that is the themes. The, currently the theme engine is in beta state and the CM11 themes are not compatible with the CM12 themes so they are adding more themes to the CM12 theme engine now the main, inside the menu you can see there are tons of options to change the theme that is the theme pack, style, icon, fonts, wallpaper, lock wallpaper, boot animation and sounds but currently there is no theme available but I have seen one theme that is on XG developer so I had downloaded it, it is material glass theme this theme is also in alpha state, so it has only few customization, as you can see only style, wallpaper, lock wallpaper and notification. So I, have to, so I will apply this now to show you how it looks. I will provide you the apk file of this theme in my description so you can check it out. Now the theme is applied. So only the wallpaper is changed and the quick toggle bar is also changed. Other things are same. So the theme engine now is beta state, we will expect more themes and more customization in the next build. So thank you for watching my video and subscribe to my Google Plus channel for more updates. Thank you.